Um, I don't know what that platform is for. Well, anyway, see ya all next time. And we're back to Let's Play Ratchet and Clank. So in this part, we're going to just go over here. Also, I didn't cut the video, I'm just cutting it. Well, well, you two continue to surprise me. Step into the ring of heroes, and I will finally give you what you deserve. Ratchet, this is no time for you to become cautious. We have reached our goal. I don't know. There's something fishy going on here. Listen to your little metal friend, Ratchet. Your destiny is mere steps away. It's just something doesn't seem right. This is it. Quark is going to help us stop Chem and Drek. Why, thank you, Clank. You've been most helpful. Get off of me, you idiot! <laughs> I love it when a plan comes together! What do you mean? What do you think he means, genius? He's not gonna help us, he's gonna kill us! You catch on quick. Although there is one problem with your hypothesis. I'm not going to kill you. You're not? No. He is. But... why? But why? It's really not that difficult to decipher. I'm the official spokesman for Drek's new planet. I can't have you two getting in the way of my comeback. This isn't over, Quark. No. But it will be soon. Okay, so... This goes pretty simple. Um, what you want to do is you actually want to jump over these stepping wave thingies. And I have no ammo. This is going to be so hard. Yeah, I looked away anyway. Dang it, the blast is really good against them too. Let's use the bomb glove, I guess, then. Come on, come on. How? There we go. Okay, so when Ibu makes a shield, what you want to do is you want to run back and you want to run over these little bridges. Because apparently his weight is too much for the bridge and he will just dunk right in like so. It'll destroy his shield and another bar of his health. So you don't have to kill him 100%ly. Which is good because it's, that, would, that would be evil, really. Buster ammo, good. I needed that. Do you want to run back over? And keep shooting him until his next bar is gone. Yeah, you can just single jump. Oh, here we go. Also, if you hit the shield, it does nothing. Just to prove it to you. Like, see, there's nothing that happens. Um. Yeah, that's just a waste of ammo. Come on, go up. Okay, if you wait a while, the platforms will go back up, but they sink almost instantly, so you don't want to try to do that like I did. Okay, apparently he wants to go this way, so let's go this way. And same concept, just to keep doing this. And, um, and sooner or later, he'll... Crap. Crap. Uh, mine glove? What? 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 Oh my god. Must pick up all my ammo. God, I hear when he does this. And extra ammo. Okay. 
Now I'm going to actually want to try to jump back over here. So let's do that first. Not close enough. And run over here. And he falls in for the last time and dies. I was actually expecting a cutscene, so... Okay, whatever. So we just want to jump over here. Maybe it can replace you. We're pinned down. We're pinned down. The ships are hammering our position from the air. That was a little too close. We need support now. Actually, I need support. My entire battalion went AWOL and left me to fight this war on my own. If the enemy doesn't kill those guys, I will. I'm not going to last much longer. Request an immediate assistance. Over and out. Those are direct ships destroying that planet. We must help that commando. Are you serious? That's it. I am out of here. Captain Quark is going to be sorry he messed with me. This is not about Captain Quark anymore. There are innocent lives being lost. Yeah? Well, I'm done with this stupid hero stuff. I got my own agenda now. Ratchet, this is not like you. What do you know about me? You spent this whole time looking for Quark. You don't know anything about me. I know that you will do the right thing. Well, right now, the thing I want to do is find Quark. How do you start this stupid thing? Have you forgotten? You need a robotic ignition system. I will start the ship if you agree to help that commando. So, blackmail, is it? Fine. Just shut up and start the ship. Back so soon? Oh, you're talking to me. I'm not in the habit of talking to myself, you buffoon. Did you get rid of them? Yes. No. Well, I, I had this plan, and I thought... You thought? You thought? I do the thinking around here, you slug-brained idiot. I simply need you to eliminate those two nuisances before they can cause any real trouble. But I wanted to be you still want to be the highly paid spokesman for my planet? Yeah. Then the next time I send you to do a job, I want results! Now get out of my sight! Okay, so Drek isn't happy. But at least now we know that Quark is working with Drek. And we stole the ship. The green one just like disappears. Well, actually no, didn't he destroy it? I can't remember. Oh well. We have a big ship now. And welcome. Add attention, you deserting maggots! The next time you soldiers try to go AWOL, I'll shoot you myself. Look, I just want to zip it, worm! You see those bombers? If you don't get to the turrets and knock those ships out of the sky, this whole planet's gonna be rubble! Meet me at the city entrance. He needs our help. Yeah? Why don't you go help him? Into another trap. Well, go on. Go fight some evil. At least I'm not a coward. Whatever. As soon as I find Quark, I'm selling you for scrap. Pretty funny. Too, because I still go after him anyway. So let's do this. So these guys are very easy to kill, and I just dropped a mine. Hold on. I'm gonna try to get one of these guys to get near me. There we go. And let's just destroy the rest of them. And we're out of ammo! <laughs> ah, dang it. So let's break this. Ten minutes. Yeah, I have a good idea what to do now. Wow, I can't afford it. Um, dang it, I really want the Devastator too. No. Oh, wait, that's something. Okay. Okay, so go into these little huts on the right side path, and you'll find uh, boxes. Dang it. 
Now, as you can see, there were actually bombs behind those boxes, which is why I say don't go up to boxes and breaking them like that. Always make sure that it's just one layer of boxes and not like a layer of boxes over some bombs. So let's actually go this way and get some bolts. That was easy. Okay, now. So what you want to do is actually do this whole entire thing without getting hurt. Or something like that. I know most of these grinding things has to do with not getting hurt when doing this. You can actually just smack these bombs and they'll blow up. And now I think I'm going to just die now. So let's just do that. You can also just jump over them like uh, so. Yeah. Now that I have told you everything, it is time to actually do this. Grinding, grinding your girlfriend, grinding, grinding this grind rail, grinding. Actually, if you grind this grind rail, that'll just look weird, won't it? Um, anyway. <laughs> There we go. I think you could just like keep smacking and it'll still work. But I wouldn't want to test that. But things like that, that's really hard to jump over. Yeah, it didn't work. Okay, whatever. There's a 90% chance you will hit them. 10% chance you won't. So. If you are tired of just jumping over them, you can just keep doing that. Who knows, maybe it'll work, maybe it won't. Um, but yeah, the skill point, I remember, does have to do with getting through this whole thing without getting hurt. But I'm not going to do that, so yeah, let's just keep going. Do, 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 do. Halt! Who are you? What are you doing? We are on a mission to save the galaxy. Speak for yourself and put your hands down. You look ridiculous. Actually, I don't care who you are. I've got to get the heck out of here. I joined the army to get money to go to college. I never knew I'd end up in a war. Go figure. This is a noble cause, sir. Noble my hiney. I just want to get home to my family. Here, I pulled this off a busted robot. Give me some bolts for a bus fare and it's yours. So, this little kid needs to get his priorities set. You should never join the army unless you actually know you want to. This guy, this guy deserves to die right here. If you don't want to join the army, don't. Thanks a bunch. Good luck saving the galaxy or whatever. Greetings, Supreme Executive Chairman Dreck. As you can see, we're about to test our newest automated pilot's helmet. This helmet allows pilots to control our latest high-tech fighters using only their thoughts. Please enjoy the demonstration. We still have a, a few minor adjustments to make. Oh, if they ever get the kinks worked out of that thing, I have got to get me one of those. If they are working for Chairman Dreck, they may know where he is. Is that all you can think about? Drek this, Drek that? I got my own problems. If you cannot see the importance of this situation, you do have problems. Yeah? Well, if you're so smart, how come you fell for Quark's stupid trick? Ah, forget it. We both need to get to this planet, and that's all that matters. So it looks like we're going to that planet, but not yet. Oh yeah, actually, there's something I need to do, actually, before I continue. Alright, this is going to be really hard. Anyway, so... Yeah, in five minutes, I'll just do it. We're gonna actually get back into our ship. And go back to... This place! And if you can't guess why, I'll give you a hint. It has to do with, um, the agent. Yes. That was a huge hint there. I, it, it's pretty obvious now. 
I need to give him my trophy. Or show him my trophy. You don't give him the booster because he but he wants to let you keep that so you can do more racing. Because there obviously would be more racing in this. And there we go. So let's just talk to him. Fantastic! You got it! Great work, kid. So, are you gonna represent me? You bet, kid. And as a signing bonus, I've got... this. Cool helmet. That is a sonic summoner. It is used to attract sand mice. Right, and it's all yours. <laughs> well, I'm off to finalize the paperwork. I'll have my people call your people. Do you have people? The Sonic Summoner allows you to interact with the mysterious and intelligent sand mice species. Despite their innocent appearance, sand mice are very effective and aggressive hunters. Simply equip the Sonic Summoner when you are near a sand mouse house and a mouse will emerge to greet you. If the mouse likes you, it may offer a bit of high caliber tactical assistance. So this is the Sonic Summoner. It makes you look weird. But if you go over here... You meet Mr. Mouse. Mr. Mouse. Mr. God. Hold on. Mr. Mouse. Yes. And what he does is he does shoot uh, enemies for you. And it's a certain amount of bullets that he uses. And I think I remember that enemies can kill him. So you have to go to one of the mice uh, spawners to get a new one. There is one achievement that I remember from this though. Yeah, see, he's, like, just killing them. Anyway. But we'll worry about that later. Until then, um, we'll, I'll just see you all next time when we pretty much go through this planet and get to the city and try and get on one of those turrets. Yeah. Whenever I, like, start talking a lot louder, it's because I'm stretching really much. Yes, really much. That is really bad. See, cre Ugh. Asians can't speak right. I speak no right. Um. Um. The sound. But I will show you. Like, if you haven't noticed, those things have been around this whole time. It, I don't know if you've noticed it. But, um, yeah. Sadly, though, we won't be able to do it. Because we are running out of time. So, anyway, see you all next time when we go and destroy all the enemies on that path. See you all soon.